classification of computers. Computer. A computer is an electronic machine operating under the control of stored instructions, capable of accepting data and processing it into meaningful information. Examples are supercomputers, mini computers, automated teller machines. Computers vary based on their data processing abilities. They are classified according to 1. Purpose 2. Data handling and functionality 3. Sizes Classification of computers by purpose According to purpose, computers are either general purpose or special purpose. General purpose computers General purpose computers are designed to perform a variety of tasks. An example is the desktop computer, which can be used to type letters, watch films, play games, etc. Special purpose computers. Special purpose computers are computers designed to perform a specific task. These type of computers have their own software built into the hardware, which helps it to perform the task. Devices such as television, washing machine, microwave ovens, traffic lights, etc. contain small computers that control their operations. Classification by data handling and functionality. This classification is done using the way data is processed. Under this classification, computers are classified into 1. Analog, 2. Digital, and then 3. Hybrid. Analog computers. Analog computers are computers that work on numeric data represented by some physical quantity. Examples are temperature and speed. Information represented by analog computers varies continuously. Examples are speedometer, thermometer, barometer, hydrometer, etc. Digital computers. Digital computers are computers that processes data in discrete form. Examples are supercomputers, mainframe computers, mini computers, and microcomputers. Hybrid computers. Hybrid computers are computers that work using both analog and digital functions. Examples are automated teller machines, modern money counting machines, the ECG prepaid meter, etc. Classification by size. There are four main types of computers under this classification. They are supercomputer, mainframe computers, mini computers and then micro computers supercomputer supercomputers are the biggest computers in the world these type of computers are large and can fill a big room they are extremely fast and very expensive supercomputers are used by big organizations for complex calculations for example NASA uses supercomputer to track and control space explorations. Mainframe computers. Mainframe computers are the second biggest computers in the world. It has a high storage capacity with great processing speed. Mainframes are very expensive. These type of computers are designed to handle serious tasks such as complex calculations. 
over 100 users can connect to this computer. Mainframe computers are normally used by big organizations such as Vodafone for billing its customers. Mini computers. Mini computers are mid-range computers used by medium-sized companies for complex computational tasks. Mini computers are mostly used as service. Servers are computers connected to other computers on a network to distribute processing among all the attached machines. Microcomputers. Microcomputers are computers that use a microprocessor as their central processing units. In common usage, the term microcomputer is sometimes referred to as a personal computer. It is sometimes referred to as a personal computer because they were purposely designed to be used by one person. Some types of microcomputers are smartphones, laptops, tablets, and desktops. Question time. Damn, Chris, this nasty, this nasty.